Hello everybody, so we had a failure of accidentally downloading <laughs> the update to the Vineland map and so now we are in a position of uh, having to start from scratch again. So what we're going to try to do this time around is we are going to try to like kind of get to the equivalent of where we were before. So first we're going to find out where we are at. Here we were, we own no property, which is what I wanted to do. And we're gonna to need to buy some farmland and we're gonna buy the farmland that we were farming before so we'll go ahead and buy 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 we're not gonna be able to afford this now huh do we own anything no, we don't. So let us let us get some money so we can buy our situation here back to where we were roughly before, which was this field here. So let's go ahead and put some cash in our pockets. Uh, we're gonna. S well, it doesn't really matter what we do. We're just buying it up right now. So we'll set it to a million. So we can buy what we need to get to where we were before. Um, we had this field. We had all three of these fields. I don't know how we were able to buy them before, but we're not able to buy them now. But whatever. Buy. And we didn't own any other property other than that. Um, but we did. Oh, look. Collectible. Is that what that is? I don't know, but whatever it is, <laughs> it's there. Um, okay, so we are going to put our house down in here that we did before. Construction, uh, buildings, farmhouses. We had a little trailer. I don't know. This was the house we had. We had something similar. This is the house I think we had. We also had a silo, which we had a really cheap silo before. So here we are. This is the silo we had before. We also had a shed. This is not a shed, it's a gas station. We had a shed. Or art thou shed? We had this one. And like that is fine. We also had a way to repair. Stop it, kitty! We had a way to repair, so we'll just put this right here on an angle. I can't put it over top, huh? So I'm just like, this is fine. Just like that. It's not going to be identical, but it's close. Um, we also had greenhouse we had a large greenhouse I believe we have a large greenhouse sitting here like roughly like that but we're, we're gonna just give ourselves some more space here yep just about we didn't have anything else we had no generators of any kind no anything and we'll sell points. We didn't have any factories. We had no animals. We didn't have any decorations. But maybe we'll maybe we'll make up our decorations. Make up some landscaping situations here in a minute. Alright, so let's paint our pathways. Is that the one that we had before? Yes. So we are gonna 
increase that. Make our driveway a little bit larger. I'll do a little smoother than that. There we go. Make our driveway nice and big. Just like that. We also had a driveway around the side of this. This was a nice large opening here. So we need to be perfect again. It connected around the corner. And then this wrapped around here. Rebuilding what used to be our situation before. The pallets were rested right here. I'm gonna pave all this like that too. It's not identical, but close enough. Here, and then we have another access point right there. Let's make this a little bit wider while we're at it. Okay. Seems a little bit better. Round that off. And now let's decorate a bit. Let's get some fencing. What kind of fencing do we want? Typical farmer fencing, probably. White, the white fences are very popular around here in Jersey. Just like that. And then these would connect. Just like that. I should probably put a gate, actually, <laughs> now that I think about it. So let's go ahead and delete. Can we delete some fence? Yeah. Should I make the fence bigger? All right, well, gotta go back to the fence here, reconnect that back up. So we got a small fence on one side and a big fence on the other. What the heck? I guess it's not built straight. What the heck? What the heck is that about? Fix that. Uh, why can't I get rid of it now? Well, that's weird. So that's going to be a false fence. Please tell me this fence works. Okay, that one works. Whatever. It's a working fence. Very strange. Alright. Now to get some other things that we had. We also had a gas tank back here. Um, this was not a gas tank. Um, containers or tools. Tools, can we put a gas? There's electric charging station. Biomethane station. Is there a diesel station here? No. Container. This was the small petrol tank that we had. That we had in the back of the building. That's where we refilled. Just 
just like that. And we also had a multi fruit buying station. Lime seeds and fertilizer, and this does everything. Um, but really, all we need is lime seeds and fertilizer. I'm not buying anything else. So we'll turn that right here. Just like that. And that's pretty much it. I don't think we have any. Oh, look at that damage to my house. Uh, I don't think there's anything else that we needed to buy for our building, so let's go buy our equipment now. Um, <clears throat> Alright, so tractors. We had a medium sized tractor with about 150 horsepower, we also had a really tiny fur tra a tractor that was barely used for anything. Um, so we are going to get something similar to that, we're going to get this John Deere this time, change it up a little bit. Um, we don't need the GPS, so we're going to buy this tractor. We are going to buy a good 150 horsepower tractor, which I believe this Fiat was what we had before. Where is it? I don't know if we have the front hydraulics on it. But probably will. I'm pretty sure we had like the largest tractor. It's not going to be perfectly the same, but... We'll do the black. I like that. Alright. Okay. And then we had... We had our cultivator. We're going to upgrade it a bit this time around. cedar which is the cedar we had and then we had a planter as well we had the, we had the yellow planter so this one configurable it's a color I don't think this is the one we own we had folded so I'm pretty sure it was this one yeah it's the planter we had fertilizer spreader we had so we had a couple we had this bigger one for lime yeah we had this one for lime and then we had a smaller one for fertilizer I think that's all we had for that and then we didn't have a mower we did have a trailer we didn't have anything else but there is now a nice cheap bale wrapper um anyways um and then trailer we had the we had i don't think we had this trailer i'm pretty sure we can customize it. It was auto loading. Yeah. I think we made a black and yellow. Just like that. And we had the 8,000 capacity. And we have that. Okay. And then we also had a harvester, which we had the this one here. We had the Ziggler. 
pretty sure. In the case, that's what we're gonna get. And the harvester from Fort as well. All right, we now officially have all these things that we need to get brought over. Um, also, I need to change some settings. All right, so let's take a look at the settings that we want to change here. Let's pause the game for a second. Time scale is fine. Economic difficulty. I don't know if we've added on. Traffic off. Season growth. Yes. Fixed visual month. Whatever. Snow on shore. Crop destruction off. Periodic plowing off. I don't need something to fill this one off. Lime required on. Weeds are on. Oh, we also had a sprayer too. Dirt is normal. Automatic engine start will leave on. Stop and go braking on. Uh, Brake button held automatically start reversing. Yep. Trailer fill it on. Limit off. Fuel usage high. Let's shut that to normal. Nobody refills anything. Maintenance costs. Let's set that down a bit. Um, colorblind mode. That's going to matter. Automatically start the game. Doesn't matter. Trailer no, depth of field on, collision. So we turn, turn the depth of field off. I think all these settings are fine. Game still paused, gotta fix that. Alright, so let us pick up a handful of things and bring it back. Question is, is what can we? Oh, I, like I said, I still need to get a. Is this gonna get picked up? Oh yeah, it's working. Cool. Um, look at that sprayer two that we had. Or art thou sprayer? We had the sprayer right here. All right, we'll check in with you guys once everything is back over there, and we will pick it up when we return. See you then.
All right, everybody, we're back after a little bit of a montage there of us doing some prep work to this field and the other fields. We are going to now fertilize this field uh, with two of my fertilizer spreaders here, just to get it done a little bit faster. Um, we are not sure if, I'm like, I'm on the fence. I want to do sunflowers or corn in the other fields, um, but... I don't know that I want to continue to do that since we've been doing it. Now that means we do have the header for it and we don't need to get rid of it, but we could um, still seed those fields with either wheat or canola if we wanted to this month or next month. I'm just on the fence about it because I can't do corn until next year. Um, but if I do corn, if I do wheat now, I won't be able to harvest the corn, the, the wheat until this uh, stage or until here and then it'll be after my corn harvest uh, my corn um, planting season so I'm not sure what I want I'm not prepared yet either for um, uh, doing like bales and I would like to do bales soon and the baler that I'm going to need is going to cost me around like $30,000 along with another bale wrapper which could start at like $10,000 so we're not there yet but I'm thinking we need to like turn this into money as soon as possible which means we won't be able to get my harvest for canola yet uh I say it's it I don't think canola is going to be ready by November it's going to be ready by June of next year probably a whole year cycle so I think we're just going to have to, um, because we want to make the money the sooner and this, we, we won't be able to harvest all of it until here, so at the very least, um, June or July. So we, we may do everything canola just to start, um, and now we can stop this. Um, now that we've done it all, um, I think that's what we're just going to do. So we're going to harp, we, now that we've done this field here um, we are just going to move on to planting the rest of these fields canola and then we will see you guys in the next episode when we have uh, grown all the canola and the canola has been uh, completed uh, geez why are we moving so slow I know that's not the working speed uh, and we'll, we'll check in with you guys when that is done uh, as well as if we, you know, anything milestone-wise happens. Um, one of the things I do want to do, though, as a whole, though, this season, uh, before the end of the episode, is I want to buy something which I think is going to be a game changer. Um, I think it's already loaded into my game system, game file. Um, so I just wanted to go do that. Uh, we're just going to finish fertilizing this field. So this game changer is going to be. It always bothered me that I have to transport water to my garden because unless if the garden is somehow like far away or I didn't drill a well there's no reason why I should transport water via a tank from one place to another it just never made sense to me so I have this uh, new mod that I downloaded that I'm going to put in is a water um, distribution distribution uh, tank um, I guess you can call it and in some way, shape, or form, it's basically going to act as my water fill point. Now, I already have a water fill point, which we can keep where it is in case we ever want to fill up from that location. But we are going to put this new one in um, on our property, too. And it's going to distribute water for us, um, like any production chain would, and put it into our greenhouse for us so we do not have to. And it will fulfill all things that need water, not just ours. Um, here it'll do it everywhere that we own property so again it seems kind of cheaty but if you think about it oops I didn't want to do that I want to drop this off this tractor's got a little bit of like a clutch issue I want to get the rest of the lime in here there we go I'm gonna drop the lime off in here so let's go show you that mod I'm talking about downloads and you should be actually you're gonna be in you're gonna be down here in construction and you should be under there we are water distribution mod for five thousand bucks 
I, I'm going to reimburse myself the $5,000 because I think for reality's sake, this is kind of silly that we're on this farm and yet for whatever reason we don't have a hose that runs from our house to the garden here. We have to ride a tank back and forth. Uh, it just seems pretty stupid to me. Um, and I shouldn't have to fill it with anything. So we're going to place it here in the place that makes sense right there. Drop that off. Let's go take a look. Storage is empty. We are aware of that. Water. And yes, it is going to supply water to our... Are you telling me I still need to put water in it? I still do. It's pretty stupid. It's pretty friggin' stupid. Oh no. Is it doing automatically? Should do this to distributing. Yeah, it's missing water. How stupid is this? Can I not just put water into it? Oh my god. Water should be free! It should be free. So dumb. We're gonna fill it up with plenty of water here. It's gonna put us in the debt, but I don't care. <laughs> Constantly distributing water now and let us replenish our dollars back to where we were roughly. Because this is pretty stupid. Set ourselves equal to 12, uh, somewhere we have $7,500 roughly. Eh, give or take. So dumb. Okay, so now this is distributing water to here. And this will always produce I got it, you're out of space. Now you should be distributing water. It should be. It should be working. This needs water. Should be working. This production distributes water. Yeah. Now distribute. You're just not working. We'll figure that out. We want it to work so I don't have to keep on doing this crap. Freaking annoying. Should just be automatically filled with water. Otherwise, we're just going to fill this thing up with water ourselves and then just move on. Put the tomatoes back on. And let's see how that goes. It's taking in. It's not taking in water. But who knows? Maybe it does that in a different way. But anywho, we'll check in with you guys in the next episode when the fields have been planted fully with canola and then we are harvesting them. We are going to continue to prep these fields by planting and fertilizing them. We are not going to roll because rolling is just too expensive at this moment. Um, and yeah, that'll be how we, uh, that'll be what we do. Let's see, can we fill you up? Yeah, we can. All right, perfect. We'll put your fertilizer right here. Uh, 
All right, done. All right, everybody. I appreciate everyone for watching. We will pick up in the next episode when the field has been harvested or is on the process of being harvested and when we've got all the other things figured out. Appreciate everyone for watching, and we'll talk to you soon. Take care.